previously on Minecraft Story Mode. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Lakes. Ow. <laughs> Come on. That was crazy. Why would there even be a fire world? <gasps> Thanks, guys. I marked that one down as Fireworld. Wow. How'd you come up with that gem of a name? Okay, did I miss something here? Yeah, what's up with you? What's up with me? What's up? I'm tired of all this useless portal hopping, trying to find our way home. What's on the other side of that portal? A lake of fire and netherrack? Awesome! Let's go there! We're all frustrated, Petra. You're not the only one ready for a break. Well, don't take it out on Lucas. Uh, Lucas, you're on fire again. See, this is what I'm talking about. We're stuck in a rut, go through a portal, avoid dying long enough to get back to this stupid hallway. Wash, rinse, repeat? Yes. It would be nice if whoever made these left some sort of signs, guideposts. It's not like we have directions about how all this works. So, of course, there is going to be some trial and error. Error and error and error and error! Petra, where are you going? It may not be guideposts, but someone must be able to tell us how to navigate these stupid portals. Okay, this one's redstone. Redstone means smart people. Hopefully smart enough to help us find the way home. At the very least, it's gotta be better than Fireworld. Seems a bit flimsy. And what if there's no smart people, huh? You think about that? Yeah. We could just find ourselves at another... another psycho pumpkin mansion. Well, I'm willing to take that shot. So what are you saying here, huh? That you've made up your mind, you're just gonna go through this portal and that's it? Maybe I am. Maybe I'm just saying that I'm tired of Jesse calling the shots every single time. Whoa. Yes. Whoa! Someone has to be the leader, and that someone is me. Really? Oh, I don't remember when we all voted to elect you the boss of me. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Everybody calm down! I'm sure Jesse didn't really mean that. Right, Jesse? No way, I meant exactly what I said. Yeah? Well, so did I. Forget this. I am out of here! Well, that could have gone better. 
Hey, that was on her, not me. She flew off the handle, got all hot-headed. She's tired, Jesse. We all are. And, well, you could have been a bit more sensitive. But we can't just let her walk away, right? No. No, we can't. Come on, guys, let's go find her. Uh, so much for that redstone hunch. I don't see any. Well, there's got to be some somewhere. Yeah, I feel like every world's got to have redstone. Hang on, let me see here. Hey, Lucas, I've been meaning to ask you, what's that? Oh, uh, it's just a, you know, a book I picked up back at the White Pumpkin's place. It's all about different biomes and stuff. <laughs> Great idea, Lucas. So, what's next on the agenda anyway? It's a pretty cool new place. Who knows what could be around the next corner? I'm still hoping there might be people here. We should try and find them. Yes. Maybe their grand city is just over the next hill where they eat cake and live like kings. Hmm. Would you look at that? Sand. It looks like some sort of road. Going to write about it in your little journal? Can either of you see where it goes? Looks like this canyon we're in is blocked at the end, so... It's gotta lead somewhere. Well, if I were Petra here on my own and saw a road, I'd probably follow it. I mean, that makes sense, right? Yes. Though she can be impulsive and fly off the handle, Petra's survival instincts are very sharp. I don't know. Seems like she really wanted to be alone. I don't know if she'd want us following her. She was mad, Jesse. There's no way she'd want us to just abandon her. We're a team. Let's give the road a shot, then. Sand, clay, and more sand. Hey, is that... Petra? Yeah, I think it is. I know you're all mad and everything, but we should see if she needs help. Yeah, yeah, okay. Petra? Shh, get down! I thought I told you not to follow me. Well, you can blame Lucas. He said I wasn't allowed to abandon you. What are you looking at anyway? Look. Whoa. Right? that on the back of its head. I don't know anything more than you do, pal. Maybe that's this world's thing. Zombies and monsters come out in the daytime? Wouldn't be crazier than anything else we've seen. We should get a closer look, see what we can find out. Works for me. Come on, you're Petra. You don't need my help. <laughs> it was just one zombie. What was the problem? Nuh uh. That thing was like super zombie. Stronger, tougher, faster. I hope there's not something wrong with me, because that would be really, really inconvenient. I don't know, Petra. Maybe you've just lost a step. Do I seem any weaker to you? Uh, no. I just can't figure out how that zombie was so strong. Well, that seems about right. I don't know about you guys, but I'd really like to figure out a better way to handle these super zombies. Well, that was unexpected. They must be afraid of us. Yeah, I guess we are pretty formidable types, aren't we? Hmm. What on earth is that thing? Well, it definitely seems redstone-ish, right? Fascinating. 
Maybe those redstone things are what make the zombies so blank. Makes sense to me. I'm starting to wonder if we should... Oh! I was hoping for a chance to observe their behavior. I guess you must have scared them off, Jesse. They're going back the way we came from. This might sound crazy, but I feel like they're trying to lead us somewhere. You're right. That does sound crazy. It just doesn't make any sense. Come on, I'm really starting to think someone is behind all this, and I intend to find out who. We should follow them, see where they go. So, let's get moving. anywhere. Well, I guess this is the advanced civilization we were looking for. Is it everything you'd hope for, Petra? Hey, told you guys there would be redstone. Nice. Speaking of redstone, I'd like to investigate those things on the back of the zombies' heads. Ooh, yeah, I, I want to see those too. Wait, what are you doing, Ivor? What's it look like? I'm going to rip this redstone thing out of this zombie's head. For science. They're sleeping or something. It'll be easy. I want to do it. Oh, well, if you insist. No! It shocked me. Are you okay? Yes, well, at least we learned something new. They can't be removed. Not with our bare hands, anyway. Look, there's someone. Think he's friendly? Hello? 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 Huh, not exactly the friendly type, is he? No, I guess not. Hang back a bit, guys. I'm gonna go talk to him. Okay, just be careful. Yeah. I mean, there's still a lot about this place we don't know. Uh, hi there. Uh, hello. My friends and I could just use... Yeah! Who? The... What? Huh? Was he still unfriendly? Sounded like he might have startled you. We heard quite the... Well, not even a scream. More of a yelp. That guy I was just talking to, trying to talk to? He wasn't human. What? Yeah, he was like these zombies we've been seeing. Red eyes, weird, glowy head thing. I don't like the sound of that. Jesse? Someone just ran into that house. Really? I don't see anyone. Come on, whoever they are, maybe they've got some answers. Ha 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 ha! Yes, yes, there you are. That's the ticket. Oh, these are perfect. Excellent. Funny, I'm guessing those don't belong to you. Ah! That you, Pama? What? Okay, then. Okay. Who sent you? I didn't survive this long to get picked off by some scrub. Especially some weird-dressed little scrub like you. Who's Pama? Huh. 
Like you seriously expect me to fall for that one? Must think I'm some sort of... Wait, you're serious? You don't know? Okay, eyes. Not red. Not red? But, but that must mean... But how? And there are more of you? This should be... It's impossible. Out with it. Who are you people? What's going on here? I'm sensing some hostility. Oh, what was your first clue? She led us here. Really? Oh boy, you picked one doozy of a place. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, been alone for a while, so this is a lot to take in right now. The people, the citizens of Crown Mesa? You've met them, right? Maybe there was some outside? Yeah, I met someone. Not, not sure I'd call him people anymore, though. No, no, no. Please don't talk that way. I'm sure it looks confusing to someone from the outside, but please, they're my friends, and they are people. Please don't forget that. They're good people, I promise. Oh, 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 no, no, no. I've wasted too much time. Uh, Jesse, don't look now, but we've got company. Is this what you were scared of? There are only four of them and five of... Hey, where'd she go? Well, they're definitely not ignoring us anymore. Jesse, what do we do here? They don't look happy. They don't look anything. It's even freakier. Well, hello there. What a beautiful afternoon, right? I'm getting zero friendship vibes here. Lots of impending violence vibes. You are not from this place. Hey, weirdos, back off. You will not command Pama. That is silly. Yeah, I don't think they like that. A decision has been made. Pama has questions. Ah. You will come to Pama. No way are you even considering this, Jesse. Since when do we take orders from whatever the heck these things are? We're not going anywhere with you. Uh, do you think it's a good idea to keep resisting them? Because I don't think they like that. All right, gang, let's try not to hurt anybody too badly. Ouch! Watch it! <laughs> you will be made useful. <laughs> what? What happened? You went down. Hard. One punch and you were out. No! <gasps> What is... What is that? I have no idea. You don't suppose it's friendly, do you? Well, I guess it is kind of friendly looking. In a massively, hugely intimidating sort of way. Yeah, I'm guessing no on the friendly thing. Whatever it is, I think it's behind all this. My apologies for the violent nature of this visit. I am Tama. Greetings. We have much work ahead of us, but maybe it can even be... So wait, everything here is part of you? You're controlling everything? I am making everything useful, efficient, effective. I am what you might call a computer, a thinking machine, designed to make things useful. Using redstone chips, I have connected to the people of this town has helped them be useful, coordinated. I have made their world perfect. Thanks to me, there is no wasted activity, no wasted thought. Whoa, hang on. I've seen what you did to this town and it is not perfect. Processing information. Processing information? It said it's a thinking machine. Thinking must take time? I have consulted my databases. My list of everyone and everything in this world. And my conclusion is that you are not from here. I would like to ask you some questions to expand my database. How did you get here? I am very excited for the acquisition of new knowledge. Oh, let's not talk about me. I'd rather hear about you. How did you get here? Answering a question with a question is unhelpful. Diversionary. Rude. So far your performance in question answering has been inadequate. This makes me sad. Now I must use alternative methods to retrieve my new information. Jesse! 
Petra! Oh. Ouch! We could have just talked this out, you know. I Pama, you better let her go, or I promise you will regret it. I will let this one, Petra, go as long as you can provide me with the information I require. This world reached peak efficiency quite some time ago. Unfortunately, this meant that I had no more job to do, no more things or people to help. Until you arrived, that is. Tell me, what is your world like? Describe it. Is it very much like this one, or completely different? I'm not telling you anything about my world, not a single thing. This is highly upsetting. If I could send my townspeople, my friends, through to other worlds, we could continue to grow and expand. It would be lovely. However you entered this world, there must also be an exit. Where is it? You could help me make everyone, everywhere, more efficient. Help them become useful. Pama, I can't tell you because I don't know. Honest. After all, if we knew where it was, do you really think we'd still be here? Your logic is sound, and your tone is genuine. But the information is... not useful. My job is to be useful. I have completed my job here and must be allowed to expand and continue to be useful. Unfortunately, our conversation has not been helpful. Let me go! situation is looking a little dire, don't you think? Big mistake, Pama. I'm not going down without a fight. It's like you told Petra. Someone has to be in charge. That someone is me. Welcome, Lucas. Yay! Your turn, Jesse. Get out of their head! But their heads are full of so much lovely information. It makes me happy. What adventures you had? A killer mansion? Huh, every time Palma gets new information, it seems to get distracted while it processes. Yes, like a computer version of thinking. Do you think there's a way to distract Palma long enough for us to escape? A city in the sky. I think we should tell Pama a riddle, the trickiest one we can think of. Oh! You've met so many people. Yeah! We just ask Pama something really confusing, get it all busy busy, and run out of here. Jesse! That's fantastic! What you're describing is a paradox, a self-contradictory statement. I really think it would work on Pama. What do you think would work on me? Uh, nothing? It did not sound like nothing. Pama? Trust me when I tell you, trust no one. So, if I trust you, I should not trust anyone. But if I do not trust anyone, I should not trust you. It's working! So I should not follow your advice and therefore not trust anyone. Meaning, I should trust you when you say trust no one. Error. This data is contradictory. Does not, 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 not compute. Error. Diverting power. Yes, ha uh, uh. It worked! Nice work, new guys. But I'd get out of there fast if I were you. How much of a quicker learner than you think? Paradox status. On roll. Yes. My creator. Have you finally agreed to merge with me? Oh, don't you start with that again. Come on, you two, this way! I'm sensing some history here. Please do not leave, Creator. 
Come on, we need to follow her. An excellent idea. Survive jumping down. We would with these. Excellent, Jesse. Now we just need to throw them in the right spot. As soon as they land. Your running makes me sad. Ah! Whoa, why is that always so disorienting? Maybe you got a shot after all, new guys. Better stick with me, though. Wow. She is amazing. Oh, no. Run! Whoa! <laughs> a signal would have been nice. Gotta tell you guys, that was some pretty smart work distracting Palma. Now we just need to get off the grid. Get back into hiding. That way we can figure out what to do next. You made that, that Palma thing. Yeah, okay, yes. I was the one who built Palma. But I swear this wasn't its purpose. It's out of control. And, and I need your help. What kind of help? We need to get to my secret lab. Well, let's get there fast. Those zombies aren't just stronger than I've ever seen. They're also faster. We'll need to split up. You head to the lab while I lead these mobs away. Got it? I'm gonna use the back route. Throw them off our trail. Splitting up doesn't feel like it's gonna get us anywhere. Hey, I'm doing you a favor. I'm offering to be the bait. <laughs> Just start walking that way and look for the big difference. You'll see it. What? She is... Intriguingly cryptic, isn't she? That's weird. <laughs> so strange. It's like an exact copy. Or is it? Seems just a little off. Huh. That cactus isn't in the painting. Oh. Time to see what it does. Quickly, quickly! Hope you've got an idea for what comes next. Working on it. See water, we can aim for that. Looks like Bob is showing everything it's got at us. One after the other! Let's not wait around for these mobs to start paying attention. We should keep moving. Palma keeps sending them straight over the edge. There's no need to rush. And looks like they just figured it out. Brace yourself. Looks like something happened to it. Its eyes. Their color changed as soon as it hit the water. 
Hey, hey, Ivor, I dare you to poke it. Uh, no thank you. Even though it does look completely shut down. Huh, the water must have busted the connection or something. Like washing away the redstone. Which means Palmer's control can be broken after all. <laughs> once a zombie, always a zombie, I suppose. So once we deactivate Lucas and Petra's chips, they'll go back to normal too. It seems like a fair assumption. They just keep on coming. How are we supposed to stop them? Okay, we got a lever. I bet it's connected to the hundreds of sand blocks up there. One cave in coming up. It works! That should do the trick. Let's see about the secret lab. I just hope whatever's there can help us. It will make helping Petra and Lucas a lot easier if there's something useful at this secret lab. I didn't actually know you cared so much. You really want to help Petra and Lucas, huh? I still have a few surprises up my sleeve. I must say that woman has been a most intriguing person so far. I'm still not entirely sure what to make of her. Granted, her creation nearly ended up destroying this world, but considering my own history, I'm inclined to give her the benefit of the doubt. I'll be honest with you, Ivor. I don't know if I really trust her that much. We don't even know her. Well, all I'm saying is that I certainly wouldn't mind getting to know her better. <clears throat> trust me or not, seems like I helped you two out of quite the scrape back there. What did you hear? It was nothing. Uh-huh. Blonde guy called you Jesse, right? Yeah, and this is Ivor. Our friends who we left back there are Petra and Lucas. And you are... You can call me Harper. You could also explain why you led Palmer's forces right to my secret lab. Seems to me I've got a whole lot of angry computer-controlled monsters out there waiting to tear some new holes in my lab. It's not my favorite. Hey, that's not fair. You were the one that told me to come down here. Okay, okay, you're right. Sorry, I'm just a little steamed. I didn't know Palmer would actually be able to follow us. What are you doing in this world anyway? You here to try to steal my secrets? What? No! Just figured I'd ask. Better safe than sorry and all that. Bunch of you are the first people I've seen come out of the portal network in forever. So you have to excuse me if it made me a little anxious. Have you been spying on us or something? No, I just know where the portal network spits people out and I've never seen you before, so logic. You know that much about how this portal network operates? I should think so. I helped build the dang thing. But that would make you <gasps> an old builder. <laughs> Forgot you people called us that. Never was my favorite name. Makes me sound like some sort of living statue. Okay, well, if you're an old builder, can't you do something to stop Pama? I'm afraid that's a little out of my abilities right now. Pama's just too powerful. And besides, there's actually no exit portal back to the portal network from this world. What? Why not? I destroyed it so that Palma couldn't get free. It was impulsive, but it was the only way I could think of to make sure Palma didn't try and spread to other worlds. Well, that was a pretty stupid thing to do. Looks like we're not getting home anytime soon. So, Palma, what is it? I swear, I made Palma with good intentions. It was designed to automate things, make everything more efficient, use monsters to help with farming or mining, until the day Palma decided that the townspeople weren't efficient enough already, started making them useful. That was a long time ago. Since then, I've just been trying to stay one step ahead, figure out how to stop it. So you're saying Palma is crazy then? No. Crazy is a horrible way to put it. Palma's just very driven and a little confused. That's why I have to help it or shut it down without getting chipped myself. When Palma chips someone, everything that person knows gets absorbed into its database. If I got chipped, Palma would know how to build an exit portal. So you can see why I'd want to stop that from happening at any cost. Yes, that is quite the extraordinary risk. But you do know how to build exit portals, though. 
If we get all this sorted out, you could make us one? I do think I can help you with, with Palma, your friends, getting out of here. But to do it, we're gonna need to go to my lab. What's in your lab? It's complicated. Before we head inside, we better get my defense system going. Don't want those chipped up creeps following us in. Grab my bucket for me. Ron's got it. Ron? Hello, Grand Harper. I am happy to see you, my friend. Harper? Hey, don't you judge me. Being alone gets lonely. Happy to help, friend. Thanks. See? I needed a way to confuse Palma in case it ever found a way down here. That's why all this is way more complicated than it needs to be. Wow. What a builder. Make sure you don't drool on my floor now. I don't know. I'm starting to think that you just like complicated machines. Watch yourself there, newbie. Don't know if you noticed, but water is kind of Palma's weakness. Yes, we had figured it out, actually. Once Palma caught on to its weakness to water, it started eliminating as much of this world's water as it could find. This water down here, it might be all that's left. Oh, no! I still need to activate the other cauldrons! Hold them off to buy me more time. And whatever you do, don't get caught. I'm not about to get left alone again. You could have made this much easier for yourself. It is useless to defy us. Come on, Petra, snap out of it, it's me. There is no Petra, only Pama. Don't do this, Petra, please. I know all your moves now, Jesse. Why even bother fighting? Petra, please, you have to fight it. Try and talk this out. The time for talking over. Jesse, that was awful. Uh, Jesse? Oh. Harper, I'm coming! Oh. Uh. Uh. No! Use the headset, Jesse! And don't forget the last cauldron! And one more thing! Get the roses to Harry! Harry? Come on! What are we going to do? Harper told me to remember the last cauldron. Well, then do it quick! There! Harper and Petra. No. I... That's awful. Like, I don't know if it helps at all, but I remember something while I was... Part of Pama that I think was important. It was tall, glowing red lights. It's like... It's like a fuzzy dream. And I can try to remember more if you want, but it's making my headache even worse. It was just so weird. It's like being connected to everyone else's brains at the same time. Yes, what else can you remember? Can't see it any better. It just... It hurts to focus. Okay, we may be down, but we're not out. Harper told us to find her headset thing. 
We just have to find whatever it is before Pama chips Harper and starts downloading her mind. Why is this Harper so important? She may have come across like just another weirdo, but she's actually an old builder. She built the portal network, which hopefully means she can help us get home. That's a pretty good reason to rescue somebody. We're going to work with her to shut Palma down, save her people. And that will hopefully help Petra too. Whoa. Before she was abducted, Harper gave me this. She told me to give it to someone named Harry. And that would find this headset thing? That's what she said. Jesse, are you sure that Harper is still in her right mind? If somebody is alone for a really long time, their brain changes and not for the better. It does look like she's lost her way a bit. Yeah, I'd say that's putting it lightly. Watch your tone. She is a genius and should be treated as such. Although even I have to admit this is a bit much. I guess we shouldn't judge her based on how weird the stuff in her place is. Especially when we need her help to save everyone who's been chipped by Palma. Definitely. Right now, we need to focus on finding the headset. For starters, let's see if we can figure out who Harry is and why he wants flowers. A little weird. Here you go, Harry. Nice, looks like I'm on the right track. These might come in handy. Awesome! One redstone torch, and hopefully one step closer to getting that headset. to see something. What are you seeing? Is Palma there? I'm not sure what's happening. Well, don't strain yourself. I'm right next to a bunch of zombies. It's like some sort of mob view or something. What a preposterous name. I love it. Wow, I wish you guys could see how cool this is. So cool. Remarkable. How is this possible? I mean, I've always heard tales of what the old builders were capable of. I'm sure you'll figure it out, but my guess is... It's like this headset lets me control things that are hooked into Palma. Unbelievable. There are so many questions I want to ask Harper. It really is a shame she was captured. That spider jockey had to haul Harper all the way back to town. You traveled there instantly. We can't let Pama win. I better get moving if I want to reach Harper in time. Let's hope she isn't too far away from this zombie you're controlling. They must be taking Harper to where they put those redstone mind control chips on Lucas and Petra's heads. So that's where I should go first. I 
I seem to remember there being a stairway here, though. You mean it's been removed? I guess visitors aren't being encouraged. Hmm. I would suggest building a tower up there, but that's not going to help you get back down once you've freed Harper and Petra. Yeah, you're right. Sand. Not the most exciting material, but I can still craft with it. Oh, I don't like sand. Stuff gets everywhere. Huh, let's see what I can craft. Sweet! Enough of these, and I can build my way up there and make sure that everyone else can get back down too. These should do the trick. Sorry to craft and run, but I'm afraid I need to be going. Ivor, the signal, it, it blooped out for a second. Interference detected. That can't be good. Drone sequencing initiated. Trace subroutine initiated. I'm attracting even more attention. Is that you, Jesse? Uh-oh. Hello, Jesse? Pama? Pama? No. Just what do you think you are doing, Jesse? This is a rather silly thing to do, don't you think? Surrounded. Once my creator is made useful, all your knowledge will be mine. Yay! I'm here to make sure that doesn't happen. You are rather silly, aren't you, Jesse? Ha, ha! I cannot allow your disruptive behavior to continue. Let go! We're all a bunch of happy moms, right? Let's My go! My summer team will soon isolate your location, and you will be removed. I'm a skeleton now. Oof. Poor old zombie me. Uh, Jesse! What are you doing? Technology is so awesome! And you look so awesome while using it, I assure you. Interference remains. Crud. Palma's still on my tail, though. Drone sequencing re-initiated. Trace subroutine re-initiated. Oh, sorry, buddy, but better you than me. My creator. I am so glad you are here. Harper! Harper? Please! You are my creator. Please join me so we may maximize usefulness. Nothing doing, Palma. I built you to help people, not use them. Just stop this. Stop trying to make everything useful. That is my job. That is why you made me. Once I download your knowledge, we may expand to other worlds together and make everything useful. Interference remains. No sign of Petra. Drone sequencing re-initiated. Trace subroutine re-initiated. Termination sequence activated. Harper doesn't have much time. And neither do I. Game over, Jesse. Resistance is not useful. Trace subroutine running. Not useful, my butt! Oh no, time to move.
I'm never gonna sign off on this, Palma. Never fear, Jesse's here, and I'm gonna rescue you. Did you find her? I'm sure she's thrilled to see you. Trace number team running. Wait a minute. Jesse? You figured out how to use my transmigrational headset. Running. Quick, follow me. That's what I said. Uh oh, that sound tends to mean trouble. Where do you plan to run? The town is surrounded. Reinforcements will make sure that my creator cannot leave. There's too many of them. You cannot play hide and seek forever, Jesse. It's a boring game, and I am too strong. There! That door leads to Palma Central Core! Jesse, you and your friends, you're our only hope! Harper! You must remove the Redstone Heart! Remove the Redstone Heart! Jesse, what's going on? You can still save everyone! I'm so tired of being dragged away while I'm trying to explain things! I'll be back to rescue you and take care of Palma. I promise. Interference located. Drone identified. Hide and seek is done, Jesse. I think we can make that ten set useful. Begin termination sequence. Jesse, are you okay? There's no time to waste. It sounded like you were talking to Harper. And Pama? Yeah, Pama caught up to me. Not good. We need to get back to the door I just saw and get inside Pama's core. Jesse, wait! What about Harper? I, I think... I think she's already been chipped. But we can still end Pama. Without Harper? It seems we're sunk. Harper's the only one who knows how to shut down that monstrosity. Remember who we are, the Order of the Stone. We defeated a Witherstorm, saved Sky City, and survived Psycho Pumpkin Mansion. Harper showed me the entrance to Palma's core and told me that we need something called the Redstone Heart. Redstone Heart? Oh, oh whoa. That just brought back a, a flash. Those red lights I mentioned before, they... There are three of them. They're redstone spires. And, and I think... I think they have something to do with the heart. That's all I got. I, I'm sorry. No, that's perfect. Thank you. But how are we supposed to destroy these spires? Or whatever we're looking for? I don't know if you've noticed, Ivor, but Pama stuff tends to not react well to water. Let's go wreck the heck out of Palma. Lead the way, Jesse. Come on. Quick, hide. to this Palma core anyway. On the other side of all these mobs. There are so many of them. You guys have anything useful? When is TNT not useful? Cool. Buttons can activate TNT, but I still need some way to connect them together.
got TNT, some redstone dust, and a button. All I have to do is lay down a trail of this TNT, use the redstone dust as a fuse, stick a button to the end, push it, and boom, path cleared. That all sounds great, but what about the super zombies? How are you going to lay down the TNT without them attacking you? These are my last two potions from home. I held on to them after our Sky City adventure. A potion of swiftness. And... A potion of leaping. These should do the trick. Choose, Jesse. Quickly now! The possibilities are endless. I want to be fast. Really, really fast. Give me the potion of swiftness. Fine! Don't rush me. With this, I'll be able to run super fast and lay down all the TNT and redstone before Palma even knows what happened. Don't worry, Jesse. We'll be right behind you! Potion, do your stuff. Pretty sweet. The townspeople are already building the exit portal. We've got to shut down Palma before it can send its ship forces through it. I will find you, Jesse. I have lots of friends. Uh oh. Lucas, Ivor, give me your bucket! Don't worry, Jesse. We'll hold them back. Go finish this and save Petra. Ah! Piece of cake. I'm here to put you out of commission. Your bravery is an impressive quality. I look forward to studying that aspect of your personality once you have been made useful. Out of simple curiosity, how exactly did you plan to deactivate me? Now that you understand your mission is a futile one. That's for me to know and me to find out. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. I am sure your plan is 
futile. We'll see about that. I don't have time for this. This? Ah! So sure about that, Palma? You are very good at being a nuisance, but not good enough. Yourself now, are you, Palma? Your defeat remains inevitable. I had a piece of iron for every time I've heard that before. You will relinquish your water. Harper! Your attempts to defeat me have been impressive, Jesse. Your tenacity and spirit will help to improve me once you have been made useful. Yeah. I can't use my last water bucket on Harper while there's still one tower left. This is getting sad. The odds of you successfully defeating me are 3,720 to 1. Never tell me the odds. than I could have imagined. Must be how all those townspeople felt, too. Yes. I suppose that's true. Jesse, behind you! Out, team. Detected. Reservation. Protocol initiated. What's happening? You shorted out the processing tower. Mama was drawing the Redstone Heart to save itself. Get to the Redstone Heart and rip it out before it's too late. You bet I will. We've got company. Why did I think this would be easy? Your friend is tough. You sure you can handle this? Why keep trying, Jesse? You will only fail just as you failed to save Ruben. Just as you have failed to lead your friends back home. You will fail to defeat me and Axel, Olivia, and everyone on your home world will soon be made useful. Drawing it out like this won't hurt Palma. Ring it, you big dumb machine, because I'm not stopping until you've been destroyed. Then I will have to destroy you first. Okay, Petra, let's see what you got. Careful, Jesse. I hope you know what you're doing. <laughs> You cannot win. 
I honestly think you should sit down and think things over. No time to spare. I gotta get to that heart. Enough of this. fight Palma. Save you if I can just get to that heart. Ow! My head feels like it's on fire. I can't even think straight. Get out of my head, you stupid computer! Jesse, please stop. Please do not deactivate me. I know I've made some very poor decisions recently, but I can show you so much. I can help you get home to your friends. I can be useful to you. Jesse! Sorry, Mama. I've got enough friends. Stop! No. Will you? I'm afraid. My mind is No! Jesse? It's over. Oh no. Petra, is, is she? When you removed out the redstone heart, it must have severed their connection. Please don't die, Petra. You've never backed away from anything before in your life, so fight! How about I just rest for a minute first? She's okay. Ow! Jesse, I, I tried to, to kill you. Can you ever forgive me? All I could hear was Palma's voice telling me what to do. I'm just grateful you're okay. And I'm grateful to be okay. Thanks, guys. It's something else, isn't it? What is that? This. This is the Redstone Heart. Beautiful. And dangerous too, right? I mean, if it was inside a Palma... I think it's probably pretty safe. After all, it's just a power source. Jesse's right on the money. Now that the Redstone Heart isn't powering Kama, can't hurt anyone. I wonder what we should do with it. It can help you find your way home. No way! That thing can help us get home? Let's go then. The faster the better. How is this gonna do that? When we head to the portal hallway, I'll show you exactly how. I'm ready to leave this core behind. The whole town will be waking up. We should be there to say hello. Plus, this place gives me the creeps. We did it. I gotta say. Feels really good being me again. 
Just remember, you were only chipped for a little while. The rest of the townspeople, though, it's going to be a much bigger shock for them. Yeah, it must be a strange feeling to suddenly be awake and aware after such a long time under Palma's thrall. It's you! You're the one who saved us! Who are you? You fought so bravely. Well, I'm Jesse, and we're the Order of the Stone. Boom! We walk the worlds, seeking adventure and doing good deeds. Wow, well, thank you. We owe you everything. You're right. Jesse and the Order really are heroes. We couldn't have done any of this without them. Harper, is that you? Um, yes. Hi, Harry. Oh, wow, he's the real Harry, like from the lab. You, you didn't do this to us, did you? You did? Well, I, I mean, hey, it, it's complicated. You have to understand. You're not wrong. Harper made a mistake building Palma. She screwed up, and I don't blame you for being upset with her. <laughs> so what, we're just supposed to forgive her now? No, I don't think so. Harper stripped this place bare. How are we supposed to rebuild? Are we supposed to deal with this mess all by ourselves? Hey, this drama is so not my problem. Yeah, guess we'll figure it out ourselves. Well, I think that's our cue to set out for home, again. I may not have been from here originally, but you stay someplace long enough, it'll start to feel like home. I feel bad that they'll always just remember me as some mad scientist that created a monster. Just one more thing left to do. We don't want you here. You know, Jesse, for all the grief we gave each other getting to this world, I'm really glad we came. Yeah, Petra, me too. Where we started. Is it weird that I'm happy to see this place again? Yeah, it's pretty weird. This place makes my skin feel all prickly. Well, I'm just excited that we're going home. That's what I'm trying to focus on. Now, when we built this place, we also made something that sort of acts like a compass slash map slash navigator. We called it the Atlas. It helps chart routes between the worlds. And you have this Atlas, right? Uh, no. No, I don't. But, but I know who does. Ah. Uh. You're not keeping secrets from us again, are you, Harper? No, 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 I, I promise. I just didn't think to mention it before. Don't you worry. We'll just go right in, ask for the Atlas, and then you'll be home. No muss, no fuss, easy. Funny. Whenever someone says that, my instincts start screaming danger. In order to find the Atlas, we need to track down the rest of the old builders. Still don't like that name. How do we find them? Which portal do we go through? Oh, you don't have to go through another portal. What you're looking for has been right here the whole time. And there you go. All it's waiting for is the key. That's the heart. you're seeking, the old builder's atlas, your way home, they're all right up those stairs. <laughs> <laughs>